Once upon a time, there was P. Little Thriggs. <laughs> well, actually, there was more than that. There was uh, Pama Mig and Papa Fig. <laughs> Papa Fig, that don't work, does it? But anyhow, all together, that was five little figs. <laughs> One day, the, the first of these pea little thrigs, he was walking down the road and he saw a man widen a ragged. <laughs> and he said, hey, mister, said, would you sell me that stroll to law? He said, I want to heal me a bounce. I want to build me a horse strauss. So he got the straw and he built him a horse strauss. And along came the big wad buff. <laughs> And he said, hey, Piddleig, let me in. <laughs> Piddleig says, not by the chair of my henny hen hen. <laughs> he said, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll hold your blouse down. <laughs> So he huffed and he puffed and he hold his blouse down. <laughs> and he ate up the pit of leg. <laughs> then the second of the pea little thrigs, he went off down the road and he saw another man widen a ragged. And he said, hey, mister. He said, would you sell me that stole of licks? <laughs> I want to heal me a bouse. <laughs> I'm going to build me a hicks house. So he built him a stouse out of Hicks. <laughs> and along came the big wad buff. And he said, hey, Piddleig, let me in. Piddleig says, not by the chair of my henny hen hen. <laughs> he said, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll hold your blouse down. So he huffed and he puffed and he hold his blouse down and he ate up the Piddleig. <laughs> then the third of the pea little thrigs, he was a little smarter. He went off down the road and he saw another man wagging a riding. Wagging a riding. <laughs> Wigging a rodin. <laughs> and he said, Hey, mister, would you sell me that bro to licks? I want to heal me a bounce. I'm going to build me a hick browse. So he built him a browse out of hicks. <laughs> Along came the big bad wolf, and he said, uh, well, that was a big wad wolf, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> he said, hey, Piddleig. He said, let me in. He said, not by the chair of my henny hen hen. He said, I'll huff and I'll huff and I'll hold your blouse down. So he huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed, and he couldn't hide his blouse down. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be careful. <laughs> he stuck his head up to the window and he said, All right, piddle leg, said you're absolutely root. <laughs> said, I can't hold your blouse down, but he said to himself, said, I'll fix him, said, I'll climb up on the roof and I'll chide down the slimney. <laughs> So he climbed on, up on the roof and he chid down the slimney. <laughs> but the third of these pea little thrigs, he was smart. He knew what was going on. So he ran in the kitchen and got him a great big pot of boiling wat hotter. <laughs> and he, he put this pot of boiling wat hotter <laughs> over the fireplace <clears throat> and the big wad buff hit it. And as soon as he hit that water, he said, ouch. He said, this is extremely painful to a wolf's gluteus maximum. <laughs> so the third of the pea little threads, he ran in the kitchen right quick and he got him a real narp shaft. And he cut that big wad wolf open and got his two little brothers out. And they had wolf stew for supper. And friends, that's good. Seasoned just right, you know, with pig ears and stuff. <laughs> and they danced and sang, and the pea little thrigs lived heavily after afterwards. 